Uterine and fibroids are a very common uh, phenomenon found in women. We don't exactly have all the information as to where they come from or how they form, but we do know that they are smooth muscle fiber found only in the uterus, but they can be found in different parts of the uterus, and therefore some of the symptoms that a patient may have depend on where those uterine fibroids exactly are found. You cannot get pregnant with uterine fibroids. Many women believe that uh, you may not be able to get pregnant when you have uterine fibroids. This is actually not completely true. Fibroids can cause some difficulty with fertility. However, that tends to be rare. Many women with fibroids get pregnant and have a normal pregnancy on a regular basis. There are no treatments for uterine fibroids. This is actually one of the biggest myths out there. Uterine fibroids have multiple options for treatment. In removing the fibroids, called a myomectomy, you don't necessarily need to remove the uterus, but you can surgically remove the fibroids. There are multiple newer modalities using radiofrequency, using ultrasound waves. When women have symptoms such as painful periods, heavy periods, irregular spotting or bleeding, multiple options can include medications uh, from the forms of non-hormonal medications like non-steroidals or hormonal medications from birth control pills to what are called GNRH uh, antagonists. These are methods that can actually suppress a woman's hormones, decreasing the ability of that fibroid to grow um, or to cause symptoms. Another myth is that fibroids are cancer. Uh, one of the reasons that we are concerned about cancer is at times if fibroids are very large, a different type of cancer can be seen within the uterus. However, fibroids themselves tend to be benign. They are, again, located only in the uterus. They are not a type of tumor or mass that will spread to another part of the body, but they will stay within the uterus and the cervix. It's important to recognize that if you have uterine fibroids, it is not a condition that you have to monitor on your own or to try and find the answers through Google. Uh, you actually can have lots of treatments and discussions with your physician, hopefully to find a method of treatment and management of your symptoms that suits your lifestyle. If you have these concerns, just realize again, talking to your physician, uh, midwife or nurse practitioner, all are good ways to start that conversation of how to manage the uterine fibroids.